Hi there, this is Allison with Let's Go Travel Tips, and I just wanted to tell you really quick here at the beginning of our Puerto Vallarta vlog two things. So first of all, you will notice in the video, we started out on a princess excursion, and not too far into it, we changed our mind, and so you will notice that change in the video. That's the first thing. The next thing I wanna make sure that you know is that on this vlog and in all of our vlogs, if you don't end up wanting to take the time to watch the whole thing, make sure that you catch our end of the day wrap up that we do at the end of every day, because that usually has some really helpful information. On this video today, I think it's very helpful and it explains why we did what we did and what we learned and um, what will hopefully be really helpful for you. And so go ahead and make sure that you catch that at the end of the video if you don't have time to watch the whole thing. Puerto Vallarta is absolutely beautiful. It is so green and lush. It is beautiful with the ocean there and it is just really, we had an exceptional day it turns out. And so I hope that you enjoy the video. Thank you so very much for watching. We really appreciate your support and be sure to subscribe if you haven't. So enjoy our day in Puerto Vallarta with us. Thank you so much. Okay, we're just walking out here to meet our group for our best of Puerto Vallarta bus tour. Lost my husband out there. There he is. See how beautiful the ship is again? It's absolutely beautiful. Bye-bye. 
like the church. The church is over there. Can you see the sign? We're going down there. Right yeah. over there. You can see the They got the little uh, statues in. It's a beautiful church, isn't it? the facilities of the first health center built in Vallarta around the year 1960. It is possible to observe on your left to a lady of Shelfers Parish. It began its construction on July 4th of 1960, thanks to the altruism and generosity of a group of faithful Catholics, aided by devoted religious citizens of the town. Its Gothic architecture houses inside an altar which stands out because of a hidden representation of the Lady of Shelters. All these bumps and bubbles. 
to your right we can spot the set a famous restaurant its name is based on the very first movie ever filmed in puerto vallarta la noche de la iguana back in 1963 this restaurant has a privileged view of bahia de banderas breakfast or dinner is highly recommended in this place it was built by the engineer marcial resendiz during the 70s it's a tradition cultural Actualmente ostenta el nombre de Hayat Siva. Lopez and Oysters. Cases and Beach Services. Like you can take a picture here, there's places to buy things, you can get a drink, you can get whatever you think you want here. This is where we're stopping to get drinks and go to the pad room. This is an awesome tour. I've never been on a hop on hop off like this, but it is amazing. I know. Isn't this beautiful?
we drive here. Estamos de regreso en la colonia Emiliano Zapata. Esta franja de terreno que se encuentra en la margen sur de Río Cuales, durante la primera mitad del siglo XX, esto era un... where you can buy the toilet. <laughs> Here's where you enter the port. This is where our bus took us from this morning. Oh, look at that. They've got COVID tests, drive through and walk-ins if you need one. There you go. That's handy to know for whatever reason. Alrighty. So here's where they bring it back. It's where we left this morning. And so you just enter the port right here. So I wanted to show you. This is sure pretty. There were people here this morning. And I thought I would take their picture and pay them a tip when we got back, but it looks like they've left. It's probably because they don't get much business now, but anyway, it's pretty. And then you can walk through here. They have a money exchange place if you need. Here's the ice cream place. They've got shopping places we walked by. And then you just show your stuff here. here. Hey there. Oh, sure. Thank you. They took our temperature there, if you didn't catch that, coming back into the port. 
this way. I think I see our ship there. Yeah. I see people going this way. Yeah, either way. Very pretty, yes? Yes, very nice. Hi there. <laughs> Got <terrible>. you. <laughs> <laughs> they do have duty free here. Hi. This is the big, this is the big champagne bottle that Yao Ming from his vineyard. And that is this new bottle that is over here in this picture. From when they christened the ship. Can you see there? Thought maybe Yeah, family my wines. And then this is the Chinese Harmony restaurant. This is where we are here down by guest services and everything. This is the Chinese Harmony restaurant right here, and right next to it is this Maori art. Isn't that just beautiful? Just let me be. You can see. And then right here is the extra excursion desk. And over here is customer service. Look how beautiful the floor is. It's a really pretty mosaic there. Is it in the park? Pardon? Oh, here. And then right through there is the Lotus Spa. We'll go that way in a minute. My husband pointed out it says this artifact represents the sea and the sky with the tapu, sacred bird. I am I flying in between. It was carved out of precious cowrie wood by the people of the four largest Maori tribes of the North Island. Presented to, to Captain Dino Sagani during the welcoming ceremony of the majestic princess 
at Bay of Islands, New Zealand on the 7th of October, 2018. So, wait, I don't even know what that is. Alrighty, so, we'll just walk this way. Here's the little spot right here. Hi, we're just here with our end of the day wrap up. And so today was our day in Puerto Vallarta, as you've seen for the, the rest of our video. And we had booked the best of Puerto Vallarta, a bus tour, and it was like from nine in the morning until two in the afternoon. And so the first stop, they took us down along where the beach walk is, kind of the shore walk there. I think is the Malacon, um, but it's just, it's really beautiful right along there. And so we got off the bus, we walked along there, and then we walked up and saw Our Lady of Guadalupe Church, mm -hmm. and we thoroughly enjoyed getting to see that. And we didn't get to have very much time there though with the tour. And so as we were heading back and starting to walk a little bit further down, we just realized that what we had really had in mind was not what we were doing on that tour. And so we decided to chart our own course and we did let the tour director know so that she didn't think she wasn't bringing two people back yeah, to the we, ship. We notified her. <laughs> yeah, we let her know so that she wouldn't be worried that she was missing two yeah. people. And so we walked around um, that area a little bit so that we could see the church longer and just enjoy that more. And then we um, went on the hop on hop off bus, which um, come to find out if you didn't already know this, it will pick you up the port or they also have a stop right there by the Malacan. I'm probably saying that wrong yeah. no, but right, right there along where the walkway is mm -hmm. along the beach and um, they come along there uh, along the beach like every hour and when we were there it was leaving it um, like at the bottom of the hour so like 11 30 12 30 1 30 yeah. and so on and so we went ahead and got on that and then if they take you if you do the loop from there Everywhere they go, then you will get back to the cruise ship about two and a half hours after mm -hmm. that. And it was amazing. Yeah, it was great. And you great. know, we have done um, the hop on hop off buses in a lot of other cities, several yeah. large cities in the mm -hmm. United States, but also in other countries. Like we've done the one in Barcelona and Helsinki. And um, was it Athens? No, I wouldn't do that in Athens. No. Somewhere else. Anyway. No. We have really um, enjoyed those, but they seem like they are very set. Like you only get off at those certain, off and on at certain stops. Yeah. But the one here is amazing. Like if you tell them what you want, they'll like take you there. Yeah. And you can make a stop. Like he would stop and we'd all get out like at these beautiful vistas over the ocean and everything. And he'd see this is a good place <laughs> for pictures. So we would. Yeah get off and do photos, get back on the bus. It was a super hot day here. And so like two times he was really nice. And he's like, well stop so you can go in. They have these OXXO stores. Mm -hmm. I don't know how they pronounce that, but um, that's how it's spelled. It's like a 7-Eleven kind of store, place. Yeah. yeah. And so he's like, okay, we'll pull in. Anybody that wants to go in and use the restroom or get a drink or whatever you want, yeah. in you go and they would just wait for us, make sure everybody got back out. He was really, really yeah. nice and made sure that we went along and saw, um, it is narrated, I would say, it's narrated in Spanish and English both, yeah. but, um, and it plays this really fabulous Mexican <laughs> music until yeah. right at the end, they kind of turned on. Picked up some 80s music. Yeah, <laughs> but um, it was really amazing. Yeah. I highly recommend that. Yeah stopped at a spot or two where there were some souvenir shops, mm -hmm. which was, is great because they were good souvenirs. Yeah, and it was just mm -hmm. like, and it wasn't, 
Mike, I didn't feel pressured to buy anything. No, no, no. it was just, yeah, we stopped. And Here's some spots. That yeah. was nice. If that's what you're doing for the day and you want to get a, a gift for somebody, you can pick mm -hmm. it up. But we highly recommend that. It was yeah. $20 each is how much, and you can pay with U.S. money. That was no problem. Yeah. So anyway, we just wanted to tell you about that, yeah. and it turned out really nice. It we was. had a really nice day. I feel like I have seen um, Puerto Vallarta the next time we come. I'm going to book my cruise a little sooner <laughs> and do an exclusive beach getaway so that we can go to one of the nicer hotels and yeah. enjoy that. But for today, this was just perfect. It was. And then this evening, we just had a really nice time. Mm -hmm. and Got and, back to the ship, went swimming, mm -hmm, had, and, had a nice dinner. Yep, and so, yeah. yeah. And they had um, a really nice show in the Vista oh, Lounge. Yeah. This was the first really night good. for it. And the singers are Ashley Rose Smith is her name. And the guy singer is Patrick Hardigan. And um, they do an outstanding really job. Good. They yeah. are in the um, Princess. That was in the Vista. Um, that was in the Vista Lounge. But I was right. just going to say they are in the Princess production the shows encore, also. Uh -huh. The, uh, the Encore show and the Sweet Soul show is tomorrow night. I think so. Yeah. And so it, they just do a really good job. Yeah, really so if good you singers. come, you should look, yeah, you should go to the Professional shows. level. Yeah, you would probably really enjoy it. Yeah. And so I also wanted to tell you, we did do a sail away from Puerto Vallarta. Mm -hmm. And so if you haven't caught that yet, you might enjoy it because it shows this, um, you know, pretty scenery as we're sailing away. And then also we had some great conversation because we have amazing people yeah. who come to our lives and, and they make it fun. And we talk about helpful, interesting things, you know, that people bring up or they put in the yeah. comments, which helps everyone. And so just invite you to that if you haven't yeah. seen it yet. Yeah. And so if you haven't subscribed yet, Go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Become a member of our Let's Go Travel Tips family. If you appreciate this video and have enjoyed seeing our day in Puerto Vallarta, please give us a thumbs up. Yeah. If you've got any questions, put them in the comments section below and we will surely get right mm -hmm. back to you as soon as we can. So we'll be talking yeah. to you again soon. You take really good care. God bless you. Love you. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.